it's one thing for me to jump off it and mess up the grab by just not grabbing down or something. It's another thing to grab down and still not grab it after getting the jump. Come on. There we go. Finally, we have a run. Saved the 0.7 seconds and actually got a min dunk. Now let's just keep that momentum going and not mess things up in every level after this point. Seriously? How did I not grab the package? Like I said, immediately just mess it up in every level. Oh well. Thankfully these first couple level these first three levels don't have any major consequences in terms of saving a ton of time or losing a ton of time. Come on. It's gonna mess up this guy's position. That's annoying. Level's actually going really well, and then I mess it up in a way I should never mess it up. But grabbing that package is a pain in the ass since one tile gap. And so unless I time my uh, turnaround perfectly, to linger over it, it's really difficult to time that grab. Come on. It's one thing to mess up like diagonal super jumps and ceiling super jumps, and then there's all the times I mess up the normal super jumps, and then I died again on this level. Why am I dying so much on this level today? I need to practice this level or some shit. I shouldn't ever have to practice this goddamn piece of crap. I'm not going to reset this time unless things go very poorly from here on out, but I'm really not happy with that. Because of how crappy Kistune is to get through without losing, like, a full minute of time or some shit, I need as much time save as I can muster from these early levels. And I can get out of Marla with 20 to 30 seconds green without much trouble. And so I need to actually be able to, you know, get that. And losing 20 se losing 15, 20 seconds on Brittle Rock Discovery is not going to help me do that.
<sighs> oh well. We're back green. Brun's not dead or anything, despite how uh, much I want to. I want to reset whenever I make that mistake I had earlier. That wasn't even a good min dunk. God damn it. Oh, come on. That was total BS. Come on. Seriously? Come on, dude. Then I lost sprint for good measure. And then I messed that jump up. Cool. That was total crap. Didn't lose that much time, but I could have saved up to six seconds on that level. And stuff like that is the reason why I'm not- I don't PB. <laughs> is because I lose time on levels I should save multiple seconds on. That's just frustrating. Run's already kind of crappy. Can't get the fastest cycle. Still saved some time, but I could have saved more. Really? That's annoying. Because now this kills crap, now the cycles are going to be all messed up, and now I'm going to lose multiple seconds on this level again. God damn it. All because I threw straight up instead of diagonal. And then I got a bad cycle here on top of it all. And not only did I get a bad cycle, this is one of the worst cycles I can get. Yay! Instead of being ahead by 30 seconds, I'm behind by 4. I'll keep going for a little bit, but... Very high chance I reset soon. Oh well, it is what it is. That's just how it goes sometimes.
Hey, I didn't lose eight seconds for dying at the end there. <laughs> That's good. Problem is so I can't even lean back in my chair half the time because the levels are so short that by the time I lean back I'm already having to reach back towards my computer and split. I just reset as soon as I got hit because I was going to mess up my trajectory. Okay. Not too bad, though. Could have been better, but I've definitely also done way worse. Like last round, I did worse. Oh, come on. This is... Besides the fact that I'm running against a gold here, this is why I always lose time on this level. And then the fact that I'm running against a gold just makes it even worse. Eight seconds down the drain because of that start. Oh well, it is what it is. Will I get the skip today on this run? Let's find out. Because I have actually technically already gotten the skip today, because I got it during the run earlier, but I didn't do the level too well. Hey, twice in a row. And it's not even usually worth going for min dunk there because I don't want to risk going too low. I can get min dunk there. I have gotten min dunk there. I don't want to risk it. Not after getting the skip. Doesn't save enough time for me for it to be worth that risk. You know, I didn't care if you saw that anyway. It's only a few tenths of a second anyway.
Okay, I'm barely gonna make it. I made it, but I barely made it. Which is a, at least a full second slower than the alternative. <sighs> okay. Now that I'm finally green again, time to lose all that time. Got that right, Ben. It is not easy being green. Okay. I mean, I'm not complaining about a gold there. I'm just confused. I'll take it, though. Because it's basically... Nothing, because it was less than tenth of a second. But, it is what it is. And now for a level that I can't get a gold on, because I am... My gold uses a strat that I am not going to use during this run, because it is not worth it. Because going fast on that cannon there, so that I can advance the cannon or the camera early, is just not worth it. It is way too inconsistent of a trick for me to go for. It's like I can get it, but I'll die more often than I would get it, so it's just not worth going for it to save like two seconds or some crap. Hey there, Doctor, remember? Welcome. I mean, if you if you find half the levels annoying, just run the other levels. And submit times just for the levels themselves. You don't have to do full campaign runs. And plus, anybody who speedruns any game ever, they will all always tell you that they find certain levels annoying. Nobody likes every level of every game that they speedrun. And if they tell you they do, they're lying. How are you kidding me? What was that? God damn it, I was gonna get the fast cycle too. Come on. <sighs> That's why the end of Kistoon sucks. It's like I like that level a lot. And I especially like it when I can get the fast cycle. It's just so easy to mess it up. And you lose a lot of time when you do. Yeah, the Ripcord levels are pretty fun. Most of the power-up levels in general in the campaign are fun. Not all of them, obviously, but a lot of them are. And the Ripcord, the Ripcord definitely has a good set of levels. They're not perfect. And I definitely am not a huge fan of all of them, but they're definitely good ones.
damn, I actually saved time on this level. That does not happen often. I'm lucky if I just break even on it, usually. But yeah, if you wanna if you wanna run the ripcord levels, you should do only air, since you can just you have to go under the map in order to run that level. And going under the map with ripcord is both very fun and satisfying, and also one of the most frustrating tricks in the game. hands are starting to sweat. Both because I'm actually on a decent run and because just playing the game a bunch makes my hands sweat. There we go. Yep, we're back green and we're not only are we back green, we're getting up to the levels where I have a ton of time to save. So I have the potential to be very green. We'll see if that actually happens, but it could. I'm not going to get my hopes up, though. Because rule number one of speedrunning, never get attached to runs. I'm not good at that still. I still get attached to runs, but that is a cardinal sin. Because when you lose the run, you're going to be way more affected than you would be otherwise when you get attached, because you will lose most of your runs. <laughs> Especially the better you get, the harder it is to actually PB again. Because I've had this PB for months, and I still have not beaten it. Grab the pet box, please. A little slow, but that's okay. Much less okay. Not too bad, but that could have been a lot better. I didn't get screwed by the RNG at the start there. That's good. Hey, and that was perfect RNG from those guys. Hell yeah. Okay, two runs in a row, I got the toe slider to just not give me momentum there. That's cool. Like, no sarcasm there. That is actually cool. Because that doesn't happen very often. It'd be way cooler if, like, you could actually predict it, because it's very possible to die because of that when you're not expecting it, but thankfully it all worked out. Huh. <sighs> okay. Hey there, Maddles. Welcome. Assuming everybody's uh, coming in. Welcome. Thank you for the raid. Hopefully, 
a uh, link to the past, whatever whatever was going on tonight went well. Because you guys, you guys play that so often, I can't keep up with what's going on any given day of the week. Welcome, Frenzy. Ooh, that's rough. Yeah. Hopefully it was still fun, even if uh, you did make a huge blunder. But that happens. That happens when things aren't random, let alone when things are. So it's completely understandable. It happens. Oh, barely got that box. Thank God. That would have been very bad if I didn't get it. Alright, not my best uh, battery drops, but that's okay. I just do it the old fashioned way. Okay. Not my best run of this, but not too shabby either. I'll be losing a little bit of time, though. Only a little bit, though. Because right, that ending was surprisingly good with how those cycles lined up. Hey, got the first try. <sighs> okay. Uh, no fast ending. I jumped a tiny bit too early. That's okay. Could have golded if I had gotten a fast ending, but I will gladly take that. If I had hit split the tiniest bit sooner, that would have golden. Whether that's that would count as a real gold or not, I don't know, but that was almost really, really good. That went surprisingly well for that level. I got very nervous at the end there because the swoops were not in the spots I was used to. But it worked out. Oh, god damn it. This corridor sucks. Because <laughs> if you get caught on that wall, you just can't get into that hole like that. Because of the goddamn layout of that room. It's just very easy to lose time as a result. Because that Sky Wiggler is just a pain in the ass. Oh well, it is what it is. God damn it, messed up the kill. I didn't notice it soon enough, so I couldn't re adjust as a result. Now I'm losing time here. That sucks. Oh well, I got good throws at least. Played the rest of the level perfectly.
Oops. Okay. I mentioned it earlier, we're gonna get, I might need to keep drying my hands for this run, because I keep getting sweaty. Squeak that out. Okay, that was a good run at that level. Thank God. That was a sub thirty five, damn. Like, I've gotten a better time than that before, but my IL record for that level used to be 35-something. And so when I... I have very few sub-35 times on that level, overall. So that's good. And now we get the Ripcord levels. Nope. I lose a little bit of time here. That sucks, but it is what it is. Let's get that pixel jump. Alright. Alright, will I get the skip? Let's find out. The answer is probably not, but you never know. And that's why you say, I always say, you never know. <laughs> why did I get that? <laughs> what the hell? Okay. Whatever. Well, followed up with that crap. Hey there, Dramus. Thank you. Yeah, I guess the Mattles Raid is all I needed. Alright, this run is mediocre. Oh, now I'm messing this up big time. Yep, cool. That's 20 seconds down the drain. Awesome. All because that swoop just was not cooperating. Excuse me? This low is going to crap. And very quickly. What is happening? I have never done that poorly on this level before. That was total bullshit. That was so goddamn bad, oh my god. That is incredibly frustrating. Okay, I messed that up, losing a little bit of time. Nothing major, but a little disappointing. Oh well, got the rest of it pretty decently, at least.
nope, messed this up. That's not good. Okay, I didn't really... Nothing too bad happened, but I'm losing a little bit of time for that. Oh, okay, that's actually really bad. Alright, what cycle are these guys on? Not a particularly good one. Okay. Not a terrible one. I made it work, but that could have been way better. Wait, why, the, why is that guy still down there? What is... What is happening? What what the fu what the fuck happened? That's ten seconds I'm not getting back. That was horseshit. Well, I got those throws first try at least. Jumped a tiny bit too early. Okay, I gotta wait for the rebound, because it's not worth going for it when it's right next to the slayer otherwise. Good run, at least, outside of the obvious mistakes. <sighs> okay. All right. All right. That's how this level's going to go. Still saved a little bit of time, but that could have been way better. <sighs> That's more what I'm used to, not last time when I golded by three seconds.
<sighs> okay. That's bad. That's gonna screw me up later. Okay, got three hits in. Didn't get as quick of a kill as I could have, but I'll take it. I didn't die, which is the important part. <sighs> okay. Cool, already messing this guy up. Also messing this guy up, and a bunch too, cool. <laughs> that was a crap run, but I pulled that out somehow. Uh, if only Sting Like a Bee didn't happen, then that actually would have been a decent run. <laughs> but that's technically world record now, by like two seconds. I would have much rather uh, taken record back, you know, with an actually decent time, like not messing tons of things up. I'll take it. It is what it is. Finally have a new PB.